Hey guys, today I'm back with Animal Crossing, and today I'm going straight back into my house. And it's Bill come straight in from the um, town hall to here. Sorry to intrude, Mayor. Wow, so exciting. It's just like you're camping, isn't it? It reminds me a lot of my childhood. Everyone get, would get all worked up and we'd roast marshmallows and, and popcorn over the fire. We'd always burn the popcorn a bit, but you know, something like that just made it extra delicious. Oh no, I got them all carried away again. I'm so sorry. Anyway, Luna, I brought you something nice. It's a lantern. It's a lantern. And... I thought I'd see someone somewhere, so I'd search through the storage closet of the town hall. I just guessed what she'd say. I thought I'd seen one somewhere, so I'd search through the so I searched through the storage closet at the town hall, and sure enough, it was there. I thought it'd be perfect for you since you're sleeping in tent. If you tap on the lower screen or press X, you can see what's inside your pockets. From there, select the lantern and choose the display to set it in the room. Can you please get it out for me? I hate, I hate it when I have to do this. This is my least favorite part when you have to play the game. Look, uh, okay, I did it. Now, can you just be done with me? Yes, just like that. Next, face the lantern and press A to turn the light on. Won't you give it a try? Normally, see leaves when you're supposed to move it, but then you can actually move it while, like, during that. Oh, super! Since it's so old, I wasn't sure if it would work properly, but it looks like it's a, it works just fine. Oh, what else? Well, if you face the lantern and hold down A while using the touchpad, it will move backward or forward, or rotate in any direction you like. Please put it wherever you want. Also, if you turn the light off, just press A again, or simply press Y to put it in your pockets. Well, that's all for me there this time. Sorry to burrow in on you like this. I'll be taking my leave now. I'll also be doing a series on Tumadachi life. Tumadachi. And add life to it. And then you've got Tumadachi life. Okay, okay. If you guys could see what it actually looks like on screen, it'd, it'd have much better light. It'd look much better because it's all pixely on there. More, it's like actually like looks. Oh, do you want it to be 3D? Here you go. Ooh. Be careful when watching this video. There is 3D. It looks so cool in 3D though. Welcome, this is your new cat machine. If you want meow coupons by participating in town initiatives, you can collect them here. Okay, I got 10 already and add 12. And go back to it because you get meow coupons for using it. Thanks for using your local cat machine. And let me check my net. I might as well check all the tabs. They have something to say about it. Me. And I don't care. And I still don't care. It's a lot of I don't care with that. You guys can see the top screen while I. I've competed. I've completed both of them. Okay, rock on. Initiative. Having a bad day? Need to release some of that pent up from Strayson? Then go ahead and smash some rocks! Uh oh, your mayo misses its best friend, Tuna. Catch one of from those and then reun reunite the classic combo. Bug boss. Bug, bug, bug boss in initiative. Bug catchers get no respect. It's time to show the world what you're capable of. So don't hold back. Go out there and catch 20 bugs. The, the water is a place for fish and fun, not trash and tires. Remove one piece of litter from the sea and rivers of Doki Doki. Doki Doki Universe and... It's also from something I like. Encyclopedia. Design. Redesign. Da da da. Da da da. Don't really care. Don't really care. 
you guys will see up there what I do. I'll, I'm gonna do this. I hope you guys like it. <laughs> I'm drawing from inspiration. My inspiration is, I don't know, craziness. Yeah, craziness. It's a cake! It's hard to see. Yeah, let's turn 3D mode off. Right? And let's redo the whole thing. Because that turned out pretty bad. Okay, start out with red. It's pink. And now it's yellow. And now it's... Me. Let's see how long I can go without using the color yellow. Whoa, you can barely see it. Off. I went, I went kind of wrong. Alright, guys. Uh, too much messing around. Quit. Quit. Oh. Hey, Sahara! Never mind. I'm gonna leave you alone because you're. Dun, dun, dun. <gasps> Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you. I'm good at singing, aren't I? Not really. Not at all. Not at all with a capital, not at all. I'm gonna check out Able Sisters. I like to go all to all the shops at the beginning of the game real quick, just to get the introductions all done and over with. Hello, welcome to the handmade fashion place of the Able Sisters. Are you, by any chance, a new mayor everyone's talking about? Oh, everyone in town has been buzzing about you, so you're quite easy to recognize. As you can see, the store mostly specializes in handmade clothes. If, we, if you'd like accessories, please look in the accessory shop that's right next door. Does that count as the Able Sisters? I don't know if it counts as part of the Able Sisters. A Mario T-shirt? Jeans that I really like. And a colorful T-shirt? I'm coming here today. <gasps> I need it. And I need you kind of. And you. I think today's color day because look. Thanks. Thanks. And this is gonna get go over a kind of fashion model and kind of bored voice. Like, uh, I hate my life right now. It's kind of nice that, like, from the old games, she used to work for. I forgot. Oh, yeah, that gazelle person. Yeah. And now she's reunited with her sisters. That's why they call it the Abel Sisters, because they're all, all three of them are sisters. Welcome, welcome. Oh, Luna, yes, yes, welcome. Have you finished everything you need to do to move in? I have, of course, completed running the numbers on your home, loan, Luna, yes, yes. It always starts out with 100, and then the next one is 10,000, and then the next one is, of course, um, 38,000. 
No, let us discuss the cost. You know, Luna, we can't build you a house unless you have all necessary costs covered. So the down payment is nothing more than a paltry 10,000 bells. Let's do it! Very good. Though we can't break ground break ground on your home until down payment is received. Hmm? But do not worry. No, no. The town has roots and cops and other resources. You'll find it easy to earn money. You can collect fruit and sea cells and take them to the recycling shop to earn quick cash. Cash, yes? Once you've saved a bit, buying a net or fishing rod at the store is a good idea as well. It is indeed. You can use such tools to go forth and catch insects and fish to sell too. An easy path to riches. Hmm? Much faster than and searching for low-paying part-time employment yet yes oh yes yes and <laughs> and and sit in animal crossing city folk you actually have to do um um low-paying part-time employment um for tom nuke so he's just making a reference to the last game of where he makes you do that so, come and see me right away when you saved up 10,000 bells. Good luck, good luck. It's a candy door! It's a candy door. It's a candy door. Thanks much. Guess what time is it? <laughs> you just saw the time, so you already know. Me. <gasps> time to introduce myself to them. <laughs> Hi. Oh, there's a stove today. Welcome, welcome. Come on in. What's this? Could it be this is your first time in our humble establishment? Our store sells a variety of furniture and useful goods for daily living. As you can see, it's a rather teeny shop, but please relax and enjoy stopping. Take your time. Dun 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 <laughs> I like doing that with them. Uh, ooh, I need it. So, <gasps> look, it looks beautiful. I need it. I don't have enough money, but I'm bring. I'm coming back with loads of money. More than a thousand because these cost five thousand, so I'll need about about two thousand if I want to buy everything I want, including from the Able Sisters. Probably more, since the Able Sisters have such a high cost. No, they don't have a huge cost, but they still kind of cost a lot. I'm gonna end soon, like a, like a minute from now. <laughs> Guess what time it is? Six. I knew it. <laughs> Come talk to Isabel for the last thing. Oh, Mayor Luna, have you settled in and finished unpacking? Hold on. Wow, really? You must be really efficient when it comes to moving. My bedroom is completely full of unpacked cardboard boxes and it, it boxes, and it feels like I moved in so long ago. Sorry, please don't tell my brother. I don't let him into my room for just this reason. Ahem, right. I was going to tell you about the town hall. For starters, right now I'm standing at the service counter. This is the information hub of Dookie Dookie. And in addition to giving advice, I also provide other services when I'm at my post in the town hall. So let me know if you ever want to change the town tune or flag, or learn about citizen satisfaction. However, to get advice or provide input, you'll need to stand at the counter like everybody else. Where you're standing now is perfect, actually. Right now, remember that your responsibilities just may almost forgot. Before you can start laying out your visit for Doki Doki, you'll need a town development permit. Getting the permit takes a bit of work, but don't worry, I'll help you out. That's what I'm here for. Sounds good. Me busy, don't worry about it. I got a whole hour of sleep last night, so I'm raring to go. Now then, there's a special chair in the back of this room that's reserved for mayor. That's you. When you need to work on an official mayoral business, just sit in that chair and I'll help you out. And come see me when I'm not overly busy, so, so we can start getting start on your town development permit. Alright, I was talking fast, and because... I needed to finish. All right, guys. So try check check out Kara Games and Teen Candy Gamer. Like, 
um, click that notifications bell in the description below. Alright guys, check out the other videos, and bye!